Welcome back. This is demo two on the live photo Secor glass integration, and I will be covering the code and Secor items that makes everything work together somewhat seamless, seamlessly. But uh, the first thing I started off doing was copying the image field and renaming it to uh, the live photo field. So the reason why I use the image field was because it stores its data as an XML value and that's pretty easy to parse out and you know work with all together. So that way I could store the media ID which it does by default then I can add a different attribute like movie ID and then anything else really that I would need. So after I copied the image field, I renamed it to Live Photo, gave it a fancy movie projector icon because the Live Photo is a motion picture in my opinion. Then I gave it a uh, the control uh, name Paragon colon Live Photo field control and that uh, is used in the code elsewhere in the config, I believe. I'll cover that later. And then I created a few new buttons in the regular menu and the web edit buttons. I copied the browse button and made a browse movies movie files button and uh, gave it the message ID of uh, live photo colon browse movie. And then I also created a view live photo button, which also uh, allows you to set the properties. And I gave the message ID of uh, live photo colon show properties. And then for the web edit buttons, I, I created two new ones and modified a uh, default image properties button. Uh, the reason why I needed to modify the image properties button was because in the code if you pass in a uh, in the XML value attribute a width or height or a attribute of an H or a W it uh, disables those buttons in the uh, model so you can't set the new size of the image if you wanted to. It's disabled and it was really frustrating trying to figure that out. So I created I created my own uh, web edit command that uh, clears out those values so that the fields are not disabled. I created a choose movie file button as well. It works pretty much like the browse movie files in a regular menu, except it limits the uh, content author uh, to only movie files. They can't select any other type of files. And then the properties. I created another edit uh, web edit command. Uh, Paragon colon set live photo properties. So let's look at the code. 